Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel and today we're going to talk about no sounds for calls problem on your iPhone with iOS 16. Let's say you got to receive a phone call but you can't hear to the person that you're trying to talk. Now if you have no sound problem on your iPhone for calls then here are a couple of steps that you guys can take to solve your problem. Now the very first thing that I'll go ahead and tell you to do is nothing but simply do a simple thing. Just go ahead and press and hold or just keep pressing the volume up button and put the sounds all the way to high. Let's say you set up your volume to high level but it still it doesn't work. Then just go ahead and restart your iPhone. Well after just giving a restart on your iPhone lets you still have the same problem. The next thing that you want to do is just go ahead and swipe down from the top here and just simply tap and hold your Bluetooth and check whether your device is connected to your any other wireless device or not. So if it is connected, all you want to do is just head over to Bluetooth settings and simply disable or turn off your Bluetooth. And after that, just go ahead and check your problem. Now, let's say you turn off your iPhone, you turn it back on, but it's still you have the same problem. All you need to do is just head over to settings on your iPhone. You need to scroll down here. And after that, all you have to do is just go ahead and choose accessibility. Now scroll down again and choose audio and visual then scroll down here and check the balance. Now if your balance is either left or right and what's going to happen it can cause a problem. So set these things into the middle here and just get out of here and check your problem. Now let's say you did all of that but still you have the same problem on your iPhone. The next thing that you want to do you just open up your settings on your iPhone then you scroll down to general and here you have to select the software update. First if there's any software available go ahead and update that if there's no software available then get back here and scroll down here and tap transfer or reset iphone choose reset and choose reset all settings now it'll prompt you for the passcode just enter your passcode over here and now just tap reset all settings do it again and your iPhone is going to take a restart and your problem is going to be solved. Well, your problem will be solved if there is no problem with the hardware. However, if you have a problem with the hardware, in that case, you want to take your iPhone to the Apple Care to solve your problem. Hey man, what's up? How's it going today? Hope you find this video useful. If you think so, drop a like and subscribe to the channel. Thank you for watching and I'll speak to you later. Peace out.